generating some buzz this summer for a reason that has very little to do with wins or losses. It has to do with gaining uh, an unfair advantage and trying to give hitters a fighting chance. So here you go. This was between innings as Kyle was coming off the mound. A little inspection of his hat. Let's take a look at the line. It has become a common sight in Major League Baseball recently. Umpires cracking down on pitchers using foreign substances on the ball. MLB threatening suspensions for violators. Now a company in Farmer's Branch thinks it might have a solution. Behold the ball mudder. Mudder as in a machine that will uniformly rub mud onto the baseball. Taking the guesswork out of a job that's currently done by clubhouse attendants who, yes, rub the game balls with mud to help the pitchers get a grip. Each ball is rubbed before each game. And there's approximately 240 balls used uh, for every game. And Major League Baseball was having trouble with each market doing them differently. Phil Small is the founder of Ball Mutter Inc. Randy Hayden, the company's IT director, knows the machine inside and out. Again, typically 240 baseballs are prepared for each game. This machine can get the job done in under an hour falls into one of six positions in the uh, processing arms of the machine. So the interior has six places for balls to be mudded all at the same time. Everybody agrees that the pitchers want a grip on the ball. I think the hitters want that, the pitchers want that. Everybody wants that. But we're trying to take out uh, the bad information, which is these balls were rubbed three days ago. Our machine We'll send everything, all the information to the cloud as to when that ball was rubbed. It'll be serialized with a number and a picture of every ball. So how does this apply to Major League Baseball's new policing of pitchers? Well, the machine can also be set to detect if those foreign substances are on the ball. Chris, go. Bar doll. Any one of them will give you another two to three inches drop on your curveball. Of course, if the uh, umps are watching me close, I just put a little jalapeno inside my nose, get it running, and if I need to load the ball up a little, just wet my nose. So if a pitcher has a foreign substance, as long as we have a list of those substances, we can tell uh, the umpires by, by a dot or a discoloration that an illegal foreign substance is put on that ball. Obviously, the inventors of the ball mutter would love to move beyond the current prototype and get this machine into every big league ballpark. Well, we believe that we've made a machine, invented a machine, uh, strictly for Major League Baseball at this time. We hope that uh, they'll come around, uh, be in touch with us, and let us know that uh, this works. We'll see if the ball